you it's it's got a it's it's a lot of story and I saw Dan playing it back in the day. Well, we we're gonna do this. This game series adapts the choices you make. All right, so choices matter. And then tomorrow we'll do a different game. It's been fun so far. Look at all this newfound knowledge. I'm gonna sign up to that Robin Hood uh, after this too. Episode one, a new day. That ain't a taxi. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Uh, why do you say that? Oh, okay, we just press numbers? Sweet. Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. Use mouse to look around, okay. I am the target of the rearview mirror. I followed your case a little bit, you being a making boy and all. You're from Macon, then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Hell. The whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. He advised uh, medical personnel en route to Hart Steel, various tents and 20 coming in. What's up, Benny Bezel? How you doing, man? I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? <laughs> What's that, sure? Sure. It's going down. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. All right, man. Brute, I'll, I'll try to. Oh, no, I, I selected the wrong one. <sighs> I meant to do number two. Oh man, I'm gonna die for sure. I won't spoil anything. It's such a good fucking game. Hell yeah, I got the entire series. Season one and season two, Michonne. So yeah, maybe we'll make our way through it. Don't worry, I never played these, anything. I'm driving this man once. He, he was the worst one. He I wouldn't stop bullshit. going on about how he didn't do it. Gotcha, Benny. He was an older fella. Big, soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying Doesn't matter at all. snotting all over right where you're sitting. Gotcha. I, I'm trying to get used to, like, selecting the right answers. I just keep on hitting one. He kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property. And I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Man. Man. You right, bro? <laughs> Not Bye. even close. They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. He sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show, people up and go mad when they believe their life is over. 
Oh, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious. If oh, I can say shit. That. Watch out. One, one. My, my, my reaction timing was so slow on that. <laughs> He getting eaten. You were right, Benny Bizzle. No more spoilers. <laughs> oh, shit. Thirsty. Ah. Fuck. My leg. Called it for sure dead, man. Oof, you got wrecked. Use the mouse to look around and find a way out of the car. Hey. Okay. Hey, officer! Don't Are you alright? I'm still cuffed back here! Mm. Why the hell did he have his gun out? I'm looking for a way out. Oh, no. Uh. I kick that shit. Hell yeah, kick it again, uh. brother. Uh. You don't look alright. No, he don't. I need to. Drag myself out that window. Look at the door. Use the mouse wheel. One or two. We're, we're gonna... I don't understand. Two. Climb out the window. Okay. We're, we're trying to figure out how to make choices. Definitely shouldn't play with Beth. Because one of you is going to cry for sure. If you play the game to the end. Of all seasons. Not just this one season. Gotcha. Okay. Used to where to move along the car, okay. Yeah, it would take me and Beth forever to get through this series, so I'm gonna do this one. I right, get the shoddy. The officer's shotgun is over there. Pick it up. Oh. Looks empty. Damn. It'll be easier to carry with these cuffs off. Yup. Let's go and uh, get some keys off this. Hopefully this Officer. dude hasn't turned. I think let's go to him. That's a spoiler, bro. No, it's not. It's not a spoiler. He hasn't seen all the characters and there's a lot. Yeah. God damn. Officer? Okay. So, where's the keys on this dude? There they are. There's what we're looking for. Get those. I mean, there's... That is Walking Dead in a nutshell. Oh, yeah. Uh, use these. How do we use these? Okay. Shit. Damn, we have to go right by his mouth? That's not where you want to be. Oh, fuck no. I knew it was coming. Holy shit. Yep. Get back. Kick him. Get away from me. Load that shit up. Let's go. Where's it? Where'd it go? Get that. Get that shotgun to the left. Get it. Shh. What the fuck, dude? I'm trying to help you. That in there? Do this. We're doing it. I didn't even hit a headshot, but we it gave us a headshot. <laughs> Run. Help. What do you need help for, Robin? I mean I'm calling you Rob Phoenix. I'm calling you Robin. Out of the frying pan is our achievement. Did I get it? Perfect. What's up? Shit. 
Not yet, homie. What the hell is this? How's your day going, buddy? All right. Uh, can we get up and get the L out of here? Can we look at anything else? Ooh, there's a little kid. Help! Go get someone! There's been a shooting! You're going to want to get the fuck up, dude. Why am I not able to move? Stand the fuck up. Oh, oh. It's the kind of game that donut should be activated for. Gotcha. I paused it. <laughs> Alright, let's get back to it. You paused it, why? Because we it's the it's the beginning of the game. We don't know we don't know all of what's going on and we're we're trying to We're just we're trying to get assimilated with the world. You can you can ask you can buy it for fifty bucks. <laughs> That's Phoenix. <laughs> you you can buy VIP for fifty bucks. <laughs> better start using some better smoke screens. <laughs> smoke screen harder pleb. Oh goodness. Hello, anybody? Let's see what's going on with this. <laughs> Phoenix, I see it. <laughs> now, tea set. I'd those teacups with some bourbon if I could. Hell oh, yeah, brother. No ladder. I'm not getting up there anyway. This leg the way it is. Help! Maybe we can get up into the tree now. Let's drop the beat. Yeah, I don't think they're working together. Mm -hmm. It didn't work. Man, things are busted today, boys. So, I know, no other team might get like. Yeah, the stream is, the stream is having problems today, man. Nothing, nothing's working like it should. It's really weird. Um, when I came in, I was having to reset a bunch of shit. We're gonna try to get up in this house. Let's look first. I wonder if anybody's home. I don't know. Can you look in? So I can see if there's zombies on the couch? Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. Grab that ass. Okay. Um. Grab that junk. No, I'm it's inappropriate, guys. What's wrong with y'all? All right. Somebody, yell if you can hear me. Better be quiet for the zombies come, dude. Oh wait, we can take that porch and go around the front of the house, or use this gate. We'll see what's up with the gate. I'm up. I'm up two dollars and fifty cents on AMC already. Hell yeah, Just man! Check inside the house through the glass door before wandering out into the neighborhood. Well, I was gonna go to the front of the house. You're right. Ah, soothing water. Since apparently, Is anybody I'm, here? Since apparently, I was just on fire. I'm going to destroy. I mean, I guess it's because of the small head, but still, the SoundCloud rapper should overrule it. Oh, I remember. I fixed that. Yeah, Brute, Brute, I fixed it to where people couldn't spam it. If one is active, 
All right, so big changes, boys. If one of the uh, the voice change thingies is active, it won't overwrite anymore. I know. I'm sorry. I forgot to tell y'all. <laughs> so let's open the door. Imagine walking around the house for no reason. Pull that shit open. Anybody can break into it. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Yeah, don't get shot. Why did you do that? Unfair. Uh, I just I had to do it so we couldn't stand. Ah. But some people want to push. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. Not an intruder. Bouncy, bouncy, bouncy. One of them. Do you, do y'all prefer it the other way to where you can override it? These people may need more help than I do. Mm. See, the problem is. All right. The problem is with the old way brute is if if I didn't if I didn't make it to where it can't be spammed, then if you use your SoundCloud wrapper while another one's getting going, it'll override it. But whatever, nothing else fails, is still maximized to a minute. So let's say we're 30 seconds into a small head channel point. And then you do a SoundCloud rapper. I'm trying to talk here. Quit slapping me. Um, then you only get 30 seconds of that SoundCloud rapper and not a full minute of it. So I had to make it to where it can't be spammed. Because regardless, it goes off one minute after it gets started. Keep it as it is. What, what's the votes? I'd rather not break it. Stay the course. <laughs> oh, we're figuring it out. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's see what's up in this house. The music is intense. Let's see a coloring book. Is it recently colored? Whoa, blood. Fuck, I just killed myself in a pool of blood. That's not gonna work then. We're gonna look like a fucking psychopath littering in the anybody else. What's that beeping? It's an answer machine. Oh, we just drank an unknown substance out of a cup that was on the counter. This place has been ransacked. Just about anything worthwhile is gone. Doesn't work to tell you. Can we get a donut as a reward? Uh, and that's not refundable. Sound like a great idea. The donut? Yeah, uh, it's not good. You can do something like that for bits. Yeah. If I'm gonna get fucking heart palpitations... You're gonna pay for it. Because... <laughs> because... This it, it gives me the, it gets me going, man. It's a Savannah area code, but that's Print. the type of note you'd leave a babysitter. Print it. Drop the beat. Hi. Here we go. There are three new messages on the answering machine. What are we gonna do? We're gonna answer it. Duh. Bars. We're gonna get to it in a second. Hi. Sean dies. Lee dies. Everyone dies. Hello. Prince Moonwalk, you better not be dropping spoilers, or I'll throw you in a boiler, and I'll fucking cook your eyeballs and your nuts, and we'll make a fucking soup out of eyeballs and your nuts, and then we'll all pass it out and eat it together. Just helping, bro. We're just making soup. It's all right, bro. <laughs> Delicious dinner. Hell yeah. You gotta get your vitamins. Let's go. Alright, we're gonna try not to slip on the blood. Try not to slip on the blood. We gotta find that answer machine. There it is. Maybe there's something on there. Maybe, brother. Three new messages. Message one. Left at 5.43 p.m. 
Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message 2. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message 3. Left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. It's 911. Okay. All right. Was that guy dropping spoilers? I don't I don't I don't know what the deal is, but it seemed like he wasn't being nice. So, fuck him. He was a douche. I agree. It seemed like he was being a douche. Um Yeah, I was trying not to read too much of what he said, so. All right, anybody drops any spoilers or whatever, Brute, you can ban them. I, don't, I seriously don't give a fuck. I just modded you. Since you know the game. I forgot these little douchebags like to come in here and try to fucking ruin the game for you. <clears throat> How many of these goddamn things Jesus Christ. Move? Tons of them. Everyone getting banned. Everyone getting banned. Fuck them. We don't need them. We got our crew right here. <laughs> oh, yeah. A year and 11 days. Hell yeah, Brute. Welcome to the inner circle, Brute. Hell yeah. Brute, M Dennis, why didn't you ban that dude? Why didn't you ban him for coming up in here and making spoilers? You should have, like, fucking swung that hammer hard. He was being a little douchebag. We love you. But most of the time... Sorry, Dennis knows. I was too busy in stocks. Got you. Fucking one percenter. <laughs> most of the time, I prefer to, like, try to figure that shit out myself. Uh, like, when people come in here talking shit or whatever, because it makes me better at dealing with it. Um, but... I mean, what can you do when someone comes in here dropping spoilers? That's that's just shitty. So, yeah, just ban them. Yeah, he deserved it right away. 100% agree. Like I said, you don't know what was real and what was fake. Yeah, I know. I half read his shit, so I ain't even tripping. We love you. I just said, he said a bunch, a bunch of people died. Sorry guys, that uh, audio needs to be adjusted. That music is swelling a little bit too hard. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No, I'm not. <laughs> Mark, it just said, I got you, I got you, Dennis. Big old, you can take off your big old business pants now. <laughs> I have free range mods, oh yeah. Where are your parents? One Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Where are you? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Oh shit! Nope. Get off me. Q. Q, 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 Q. E. 
fuck out of here. No, don't slip. Oh, fuck. He just got KO. Shit balls. Neck would have been broken and everything. Back the fuck up, bro. Sorry about the babysitter, kid. <laughs> Adventure and babysitting. <laughs> Man. Jesus Christ. Holy hell, yeah. I leveled up quick. Six more than what I had before? Hell yeah, Dennis. Did you kill it? I don't know. I think so. This game probably will Sometimes they come back. Have I'm you stuck killed here one? finally getting in this no, one. No, but they get shot a lot. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while. I was thinking I was thinking it would be easier to control the the choices on the uh the mouse though. Like it felt like it's easier to move the mouse around than to use it with the joystick on here. Cuz it's all Here, we can try to get back into the game and see how you it know. is. Oh. Look. I don't know what happened. Damn, I gotta go. Look after you, Take it easy, Ben and Bizzle. What should we do now? Got out of here once the sun goes down. Look for help before it gets dark. We need to get out of this neighborhood. It's not safe. We're less likely to be seen if we move at Quick night. Quick time events, gotcha. My okay. parents might come home. We won't go far. We'll try to find shelter and come back here with others. That sounds good. But we can hide in my treehouse until then. It'll be a tough climb with this leg, but that's a good idea. Let's go. Stay close to me. Then this guy falls down more than the dumb blonde in a horror movie. Yeah, he does. <laughs> yes, he does. Now, let's stay quiet. We'll head out to the front yard and follow the road out of the neighborhood. Okay. It'll Did I just make a choice to go out during the dark? I thought I was making a choice to get out of there before it got dark. We'll be okay. Stay near me, and we'll move as fast as we can. This is a fucking horrible decision. Yeah, I thought I was going to go find a safer place to bunker down. And then in the dark, stay there. Let's see if the door opens up. Nope, oh, okay. We're just going to the gate. Water? Oh, I do need to start paying attention to that thing. I've been getting thirsty. I don't like boys. I just crushed that bottle of water like a man. Alright, let's go. Yeah, I regret this decision. I found the bastard. I promise you, it ain't me. Die? No. I want my dad. Come time is really upset now. Stay yeah, there. sorry. Georgia State Patrol. Dude, he won't listen to that. We're friendly. There's a little girl here. Shit, you're not one of those things. Neither of us are. Oh, damn, you've got a little girl. We're sorry about that. Well, Andre's sorry about that. It's Officer Mitchell. My name's Sean. Sean Green. This is Andre. Officer Mitchell. Did you see any of those things? One Cut of them her. just got our buddy Chet. I, 
I just saw a girl inside that house. Nah, it wasn't him. Oh shit, you hurt your leg pretty bad. Look, help us find the thing that got our buddy, and we'll take you and your daughter down to my dad's farm to safety. He should be able to fix your leg up too. I'm not a dad. Um. Just some guy. Some guy? Yeah. She's alone? Whoever you are, let's get a move on. We just were. Oh, shit, no. Shit. It's Chad. Let's go. Get to my car. Fucking Chad. No. Also, what the hell did you do? I've never seen them shoot before. Usually they're trying to push a car and you help them. Is this the original game or is this a remastered version? I don't know. They probably shot because I looked like I was w the walking dead because he has a bum leg. Achievement I got is you're in charge. Is this the original game or the remastered version? I think it's got to be the original. Whatever's on Steam. Say hi to your dad for me. Yeah. I'm sorry, Sean. Chet was a good dude. One of the best. Take care of you two. Thank God you're okay. Parts. The original game, if you made I was worried to be bad here, better, too. And try it as usual. How most people play, place. gotcha. Well, breaking down the way, thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I ran into Andre outside of Atlanta, and, uh, Chet, he got killed. No, you're kidding. Those things got him. Dad, I don't know what's going on. I'm sorry, Sean. You've brought a couple guests. Uh... Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter, then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well... Just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Rewatching New Light? Hell yeah, bro. I'm hoping so. I was just trying to be honest uh, when they're asking if he's some guy because he really is. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Herschel! Holy shit! How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed before the car accident? Just uh, out for a drive. Now he's suspicious. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with, the girl? I was with a police officer. Scott digging, dude. Giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. <laughs> House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad, so I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. But what happened to your friend? Maybe that's not a bad idea. Those cricket sounds are a little intense. It smells like... Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? 
just More like that. An hour, I think it depends on when the dad decides to take me. Gotcha, okay, buddy. I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Any idea how old she is right now? But she seems like Harmony's age. She's about 10? Okay. I feel like she's younger, like 7 or 8. Hey, get up. Here comes the money! Here we go! Huh? I'm itchy. Oh, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of a fence. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. Uh, commands work again. That's my boy. It's Kenji. weird. I didn't even we do call anything. Him Duck, though. Start of the story when I was around 11 or 12. Oh, shit, okay. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Grow up the characters, guys. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan, then. Shit, Honey, Christ. Duck, this is Lee. And uh, what's the girl's name? The little Clementine. boy looks like the one from Clementine. Toy Story. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. It does, yeah. Yeah. Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Oh boy, that's fucked up. In season one, she is eight before she, before it ends, she's nine. Gotcha, okay. Zombie apocalypse happens. Where are you guys going? You have such pretty hair. It gets uh, lots of tangles. Be sure to check with everyone you've met so far. Gotcha, okay. Zombie apocalypse happens. What do we do? Go out to Pawpaw's place. He has guns. Get the fuck out of the city. No, number one thing, get the hell out of the city. Try, try to take some stuff with us. But man, a zombie apocalypse would suck dick. Like, it would... Any apocalypse would be fucking horrible. Because what I've always said, you can't just go and get some fucking Taco Bell. You can't go eat at Chili's. You can't buy beer. You can't, you can't just sit around, fucking watch Netflix. Apocalypse would be absolute ass. We go into the mountains, boys. <laughs> Streamers only. <laughs> Gonna need mods. <laughs> Makes sense. I'm still waiting for uh, for the zombie apocalypse. I'm so hyped. Shut up. Hey, I'm a streamer. Oh my god, you're all trash. Apocalypse would suck ass. All right, how do I check with these two? I guess there's no option to. Thanks, we know everything. Where is everybody else? How do you select this uh, walkie-talkie? I don't think there's an option to. Oh. Seems like those two are getting along. Let's go check and see what's up with this dude. He seems like an alright dude. Okay. Can we go get close to him and talk to him? Hey there, uh, Kenny. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will... Can I join? Tiffany, yeah, yeah, the the, the farm farms always need tilling. I mean, we you've got... In, in any, like, like, civilization, you need pawns. So, yeah, the more pawns that we can have... Tiffany, come on. <laughs> Before the zombie apocalypse, I can work at Taco Bell and you can bring me all the supplies and I will make tacos. Okay, gotcha. Right. The rich thing. 
on the odd ch tacos are probably gonna suck you've never made taco bell tacos in your life have you brute <laughs> you need females to reproduce <laughs> fuck you <laughs> Chance things oh, got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Uh, Tiffany, I'm not a pawn, I'll shank your ass. Tiffany can't reproduce. I'm underage, so what would I do? You're in the cellar making moonshine, hell yeah. Oh, Tiffany, you can... Can you make moonshine? You definitely be making moonshine. How's your son done? Oh, need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? I have no idea what I'm doing. At least you're honest. Shit. Better than I was when Duck showed up. You'll figure it out. See you. Oh, if you shank someone, you will be in jail cell made of hay or something. I don't know. We would be very poor, so it wouldn't be there for long. Well, Carl said, sadly, I can't reproduce, but I can make some serious shine. Hell yeah. Why can't you? Okay, let's see. Let's go find the other people and see what's cracking before we head out. Brute's like, oh, that makes sense. Uh, let's go talk to this dude. It seems weird to just approach the kid and talk to him. Sean's like still working on that fence. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Damn. Oh shit, damn. Have you done any tattoo work, Teth? He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. It, they don't fall like you think. Phoenix, this has been a long do time. You have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh... Bastard. Poor girl's brains in. <laughs> Whoa. I couldn't do that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. Oh, that means you can help me out if someone says they are trans men. Does that mean that they are a man now, a female, or does it mean they were a female? It Either one. Because I feel like it doesn't make sense if you're a man to say man because I'm truly confused. I, I don't think it matters. But being from the South kind of requires me to know how to fire a gun. I can learn absolutely. What's up, Faded? I see you. Uh, I think I think either way, brute. So I guess I'm in charge of the weapons and tactics. Okay, seems seems good to me. Yeah, probably you and Faded. Faded, do you have do you have any actual weapons training, or is it just Tarkov? Transman means they are a man now. Gotcha. Okay. What's up, Rage or Nina? How are you doing? Yeah. What up, Head? Hi. But why not just say you're a man? I won't question it. Yeah. That's a good point. I don't know. 
I guess they tailor to your audience, I guess. I don't know. Some people are weird. Trans female means male to female. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Raise the sun. What's up, buddy? It's their identity. It's their thing. I lived in Vegas, so I got to shoot all the guns out in the desert freely. If that counts. Hell yeah, I mean, it does count for something. That's why it confuses me. Gotcha. What's up, Crescents? How you doing, buddy? Oh, we're not we're not gonna do the 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 chopper right now. I feel like people have been seeing it too often. Unless you really, really want to see it. Uh, close enough to the apocalypse. Can't be picky. <laughs> you're right. You're right. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. I'm sorry about your friend. Thanks. I appreciate it, man. Good, good, man. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Oh. Oh, yeah, one. Well, what's the deal with this tractor? You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. I need my points back then? I'll give them back to you, buddy. Fourth time I've seen this gameplay. Proud? Gotcha. I think I need to give everybody back some points here for a second. Points, 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 points. All right, there you go. Let's get back to it. Let's talk to old Herschel. Why didn't you give me the stink eye? How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm, well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parent? My parents are in Macon. My parents are in Macon with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Go! I'll get my gun! Where no one to? All right, let's go. Oh shit, the kid ran over him. Oh shit. That's not good. Uh, it's always the kid. You always gotta save the kid. What the fuck? Go. Choose to save. How do I save him? There we go. Get off of him. Yeah, be a man. Grab, get up there and grab that kid. Yeah, hit this dude. Nice. Good job, man. I got you. Now, Sean. Get this tractor off of me! Please, help me, please! Yep. Oh, shit, dude. You're done, son. Oh, 
You gotta think about keeping your group strong. Shut up, Dennis. <laughs> Wrong choice. Shut up, you bunch of idiots. Kid'll grow up. Which mountain would you like to base up on? Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. Yeah, dead motherfucker. I thought I could help them both. Look at him. You thought wrong. And now, please, just go. Get out and never come back. <laughs> Shut up, Dennis. <laughs> It's his house, and yeah. What the deal was is it was nobody's fault. Well, it was the kid's fault, so uh, it's tricky. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. See, now you're kicked off the primo spot. Yeah, mountains. I don't know. Why? Why? Why would we hold up in a mountain? Who? Who made this decision to hold up in a mountain? That sounds stupid. Where do you get the water from? Zombies can't climb, jeez. Really? Well, this is as I far did as we're going. This is a stupid it's decision, Phoenix. We we need to we need to stay where we can get some water and some food. I don't see no deer in the mountains. There's all a bunch of goats. You wanna eat goats for the rest of the apocalypse? I don't. I want some deer. I mean we can't find food. We, we can find some food. Yeah, I'm just gonna climb off on. Hey there, you friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Oh. Fuck! Yeah, they're they're getting some num nums. Don't think so. Just shut up. We're trapped! Ah! No! 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 Jesus Christ. What a black summer type shit. And we can't just let people die either. Black summer type zombies? Stay shut no matter what. I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? They would have died out there. We have kids with us. I see one little girl. Well, where's the boy? What is it? I I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. I bet you would. Then just go. They've got kids, that was Lily. Rude. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're in a war zone. Rude, exactly, yeah. Lee, can you believe this lady? That lady is my head. daughter. Don't worry about it. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha bro. My son won't grow up to be a raging fucking lunatic, that's for certain. Son? Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No. I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! We, what do we do about <laughs> this guy? <laughs> it's just a boy. It, Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You need to calm down. We reason with him. The bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck cry, up. Cry. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. 
But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things! What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten! Lee, stop this! It's upsetting him! Oh, I'm upsetting him! Upsetting is getting eaten alive! Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. It's Larry, right? Man, this is his son. Look around, dumbass. I got a daughter uh. in here. You got a daughter in here. Get your head out of your ass, boy. We've all got people in here. We can figure this out without killing anybody. There's another way. Yeah, with a shovel. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. It could be a zombie. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. And then, there'll be three. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here! <laughs> yep. Jesus! Come and talk. Oh god, he falls down so much. Get up. Go, 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 go. <laughs> Ooh. I know sending her to the bathroom was a mistake. Uh, guys? Uh, I was trying to save her. What the hell? Everybody down. Stay quiet. Clumsy, yeah. It's bullshit. They're gonna get in. Shut up. Is that the military? I don't know. God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, oh, I literally hate this Dad! guy. Thank goodness he had a heart attack. So glad he had a heart attack. <laughs> Don't you try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's his heart. Good. Like pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills. Dude. Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Business like Please up, try yeah. to get in there, behind the counter where the pills are. There's probably another entrance, maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible Bert? so we can all get out of downtown. Sounds like you're just trying to get fast. free nudes. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. Damn, that'd be great. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm quick, and I know make it. Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. Why well, doesn't matter Doug, if you're underage? You got it. You can scavenge. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. It's not like I got your mind out of the gutter. No, no, I'm saying, like, in a, zomb in a zombie apocalypse, you can still scavenge for food just like an adult could. 
Alright, where's, where's this... What's all this stuff? Work board. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not uh, suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. There's a thing called appraisers. I have use only Yeah, there's tons of stuff, man. I think he knows, though. He's, he's a teenage boy. He knows. Well, this place didn't get looted. <laughs> All right, how do we get in here? What was that? Look. The pills are in there. Take that energy bar, man. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Is he having problems with his heart? I'd care more if he wasn't such a dickhead. I kill myself. I got that. Don't worry about anything like that. You good, man? This way without falling. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Okay, got it, got it. I want to check the first aid kit though, right here. The first aid kit. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Okay, I guess we're gonna move the pallets and stuff. Visually, the game holds up well? Absolutely. What's that? Looks like a cane. This was my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this, this is place his better place. than any guard dog I didn't know that. could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Yeah, that's what I thought I was trying to do. We ought to clear this door for when we find the keys. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Mm. How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. Mm. Mm. Eleven. Zombies in one room. Do you Did have you? kids? No. You don't have a family? What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I uh, teach history, writing, and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. All right, a little further. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? I don't, I don't, I don't know. Like, I don't, I don't know what's up with his family. I hope not. It's just complicated, that's all. Why? It just is. But you love them, right? 
Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen, and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Ow! Are you okay? I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. Maybe what we need is now in here. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Come home, and I'm not there. They'll uh, track us down. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? That's the door to the pharmacy. We oh. should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Yeah, I meant to do this. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. Hmm. Alright, keys, keys, keys. Something this. Dad, that get the TV? remote for that thing in here someplace. I don't think I'm gonna need the remote. I don't know how There's a the photo over there. That's the fan bound. What that happen? I got affected in the open world. Or cut from there. Find anything? It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. I paid attention to that trial. Kill her! No, I'm just kidding. But I don't really care. Frankly, Good. that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? She knows too much. <laughs> no. Sticking to first names for a reason. Why, why would that need to come up? You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, she because if this lasts longer than a few did. days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. She just origin I'll story just keep dumped. It to myself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. Get off my, get off my back, woman. I'm just trying to find some keys. The parents came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector, at least. All right, we're, I guess we're going to have to go somewhere else to get some keys. Want to head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Leave? Them lifetime yeah. You're not bad, right? 
I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he She's was fine. one of the things trying to eat you? It's complicated. Sometimes things happen or you do things and you can't explain them. Let's uh, head back to the others. I'm sorry, can someone tell me the question that she asked? Because I like, as soon as she asked the question, I'm like, I have no idea what she said. That's why I just replied that it's complicated. I'm just really focused on trying to find the keys. She asked, you're a bad guy because she heard you kill someone. Gotcha. Okay, good. Okay, thank you. It's not a bad a bad choice to make, just saying it's complicated. And then she asked if it was a zombie or not. Those wanna be the keys, would they? So here's an ATM. And then you answer no, it's complicated. Gotcha. Foul it away up there. Hey there, uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kinda in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee, what's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. You got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do... Somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. Jump up brackets on the end. Um. Oh wait, I need that candy bar. Or granola bar. We can't let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. No. What is this? Oh, what kind of bracket is this? Yeah, those ones. I don't remember them very well. We just need to get back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. Yeah, I need keys. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. There's... That's a, that's a perfect barcode. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Okay... So... This dude's just gonna die because I can't find the keys. What is this? It's not much, but here. You Why sure? Am I... Yeah, I didn't mean to get that to quite her. a bit of stress. Thanks. That's uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. I, I wanted to keep that. Okay, I'm gonna go in here and look one more time for freaking keys, and then I guess he's just not getting his pills. be looked at. Luckily, there's nothing I need in here. Mm. Only thing we can do is mess with the TV. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Oh, maybe it would work. If it 
notes and change the size of those. So, a legit barcode, yeah? That's what I figured. See? Apocalypse sucks. No TV. Fucking ass time. Worst time ever. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Mm hmm. Yeah. Well, we have no keys. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're going to help Larry. Oh. What's not happening? How you doing? Okay. Have you seen keys? Kids are always looking around. Everyone out there seem all right to you. Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. I was scared. Yeah. I was far away. That lady saved me. I don't say she did. Maybe stay closer next time, so you're not so far away. I'm gonna try. Good. How's your thing? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. Okay. I gained back some I'm trust by asking. Okay. I have an internet for sure because military would need a connection. I wish someone could intercept their comms. Okay. Out of here. We would need to find password to the internet, but we could do it. Password to the internet. I couldn't even find my password to Robert. How can I with those things out there? Let's see. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. This guy is creeper, dude. This doesn't seem like a good idea, but I don't know where the keys are. Great views. I think I'm gonna be stuck. <laughs> they just eat. As far as I can Every time you speak, they're static in your mic. Really? That sucks. They eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Is it static? All right. We got a remote. We can talk to Doug. So uh, there's did a hardware store. Trying to get in there and get weapons. I did, but it was too though? risky. Okay. And then a bunch of guys showed up, and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. It's a combination lock. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hell than this, huh? Oh, it's his bro. Oh, shit. What? Do you know that guy? Kind of. He has a familiar face. Oh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know? They start rotting and get all chewed up. Shut up, dog. Uniform. No. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. The picture. How do I access that picture over there? Like, show him picture. Take brick. How about I just like I don't Can need to show a picture. Brick. Page 
Hey Doug, can you reach that brick? Think you can do anything with this? Yeah, I used to fiddle around with stuff like that when I was a kid, but there's not much to do with it now. How's the zombie not see I you? My robots. I know, I know. You're a strange guy, Doug. I know. I know. Alright, how do I give him the picture? Oh, like, oh, I'm just How'd you end up here? How'd you end up here? Well, I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just Think makes you sense. Didn't do anything? So he's local. You probably right. knew the owners of this place. Right. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing. What about you? I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh. So like I've heard a bomb or something. Owners, then? <laughs> yeah. yeah Absolutely. Did. Good people. Alright, I'm I'm done. I don't think we can do anything out here. I don't know why we're not telling him to grab the brick. We don't even know the combination. What am I gonna use a remote on it? Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. There we go. That guy over there has the keys. How can you figure sure? it out? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. As much as he falls, he's not the Maybe one that needs to go out there. Distract them and buy you some time. Well, he didn't like the remote idea. So we'd need something else. If we could get that brick right there. Hey, do you think you can grab that brick? Okay, I guess we're just going back. inside. Okay. Thirty-nine trillion possibilities and what there are fifty digit assume on the fifty digit code. Okay. What is this? You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter, especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. Uh. You ready to head out? You got it. You? In a minute. Okay, let me know. Talk to Carla. Why? Okay. Not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. We know, oh, no, all right, so we probably need the cane to pull the bro bro brick to us. We want to be able to hack into any, especially with a fake internet server. Gotcha. How do we grab this? I don't think that's an option to grab that cane. How are we supposed to get the freaking brick then? To go do something stupid like try to distract the zombies with a brick so we can get the keys off of Dead Brother's body. Try bringing the woman. Which one? This one? Hey, do you think you can pick up a brick? How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. That's my thought process. Absolutely. <laughs> my dad's Larry. Or are you saying she can do what a man can't? I was can't? doing what I had to earlier. <laughs> Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that gotcha. violence before with my dad, that didn't help. Was... I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. Oh, good. and Lee? Yeah? It was a crazy situation and you froze. Before, with that thing coming out of the bathroom... How did I freeze? Yeah. Just don't beat yourself up over it. We stick together and we'll be okay. He fell. Maybe it was the wrong combo of people, I don't know. Gotcha, okay, okay. I don't need to look at the freaking menu. I don't see any options. I haven't talked to this kid. Hey Lee. You really gave that old man hell. Yeah. 
We got pushed, you know? You don't have to tell me. I was ready to tear the man's head off. Thank anyway, you, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. How about you, Duck? We've all been through a lot. What's the plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Where are they? Should we go looking for them? They're uh, gone. Oh my goodness. Do you think? How? I just know, all right? Cat, it's not our business. Lee, you got a second? Sure. Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It's not, we saved the kid. It happened pretty fast. I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves, okay? We killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happened. We didn't make a choice that killed John. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment, things are really out of control. You don't have any choice. I guess. Try to let it go. Thought you were a tough guy. We go softy. I have to leave for work. Have a good stream. Bye, bye, Brute. Have a good one, buddy. Make, make, make that stack that paper. All right, dude. Let's let's go with her. Let's let's go, sister. Hey, Carly. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Yeah. Yeah. We've exhausted let's all go. of our options, from what I can see. We can't grab brick. We don't know where the keys are. Frosty, why do you have to be there? Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn. All right, then. Wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go. Now. Listen. I was out here looking for gas, and then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked, and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started crying. <laughs> Does that happen to you boys? You, you saw a girl, you talked to her, and she got frightened? <laughs> but that's, I bet that's pretty common, Glenn, does not it? <laughs> saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me. And I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. Uh, I'm saving her. With or without you. Think about if it was you. Mm-hmm. Well, Relationships get scarce in the apocalypse. Mm-hmm. Got a hero up. Oh, I see that axe on the wall. <laughs> Phoenix, you're gonna have to make some brave uh, decisions. Okay. This is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Isn't your woman in Germany though? So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Peek up over the wall. Peek for too long, you'll be seen. Go down. Okay, I went down. We should be good. Nothing that way, okay. Alright. Crawl. I just want to look. lurking on the other side of that car. Okay. Okay. 
Yes, her and her son are still there. Gotcha. Any idea when they're when they're? Any idea when they're coming your way? Nope, ain't doing that. That's our only option is to get a freaking screwdriver? This is a shitty decisions. Why does it keep on taking me that way? So up and right go the same directions. Absolutely, they go the same place. Alright, get on that. Let's keep looking around. Oh god, it's stupid to come over to this truck. Is there anywhere else we can go? You need to find a weapon. Uh, this is dumb. All right, I guess we're breaking the glass. This seems super stupid. I don't like that this is my option. Ow! Yeah. Hey man, <laughs> that drew some attention. Be careful. Yeah, I'm. We're gonna have to get to the side. We're not. We're not. We're not doing this. We're. We're done. Get away from it. Get away from the truck. Go back to where we were. Well, I can't go back to where we were. Like, my only option is to look... Go, go... Oh, here we go, here we go. This is what I mean. This is what we're trying to do. A little bit frustrated, so I'm gonna dip now. Alright, Phoenix. Hope you have a great stream. I appreciate you, buddy. Don't they drink more room temp there? Beer? Yeah, I think so. Thought that thing about. Thought that was a thing in Germany. Got you. Okay. I can. There we go. There's where. We're... That's an option. Don't see me. Don't see me. Don't bother. Don't bother. Okay. Holy shit! Come back. Okay. We're a little naked out here, except for Carly's gone, and we can't use that much. Oh, this is trash. Can we go up? Can't go up. This is dumb. Alright, it seems like the only option to get a weapon is to... Like, because I can't mess with that dude. Is to go and beat up the truck with my elbow and hurt it. I hate this decision. You sure he had a thing on the body to focus his on? Sure he had a thing on the body. Huh? Wait, let me see. Oh, I didn't even see this. Do something with that car, I bet. If it weren't for that fellow lurking near the front. Are you talking about back of the RV? The zombie had like a spot to click on. He did? Same with the other zombie. I don't know if it's anything or not. You're saying this zombie had something to click on? Because I was looking and I didn't see nothing. But we'll try it. Because I hate the breaking the glass idea on the truck. Those are the, dumb, the dumbest. Oh, I didn't even notice this pillow. There's Ooh. a pillow over there. That's gonna help as far us. As I got when it came to supply gathering. I might have an idea for it. What the fuck are you gonna do with a pillow, bro? Good luck smothering them to death. <laughs> That's not really what I have in mind. I have no idea what he has in mind to do with a freaking pillow. All right, nothing else. So I'm gonna take this. There's only weapons. There's only an option to talk to him. There's nothing doing with that dude. This dude, we can smother him. One pillow and two corpses. An age-old problem. Well, 
I got one pillow and two corpses. An age-old problem. Okay, okay. All right, I get it. I get it. Use the pillow on the truck. I just figured it out. Why use it on the zombie? That's a dumb idea. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got you. I got you. Like, yeah. Well, we'll go smother the zombie. Sorry. I'm finally putting it together. Goodness gracious. We've been here. You know what's in there. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> okay. Get away. One one last thing to try. Zombies. Okay, so we got some options. We can push it or are we gonna open it up? I wanna see what's inside first. Reverse. Alright, I mean neutral. Push it and smash the zombie. Spark plug. You can use those to bust open, um... You can use those to bust open, uh, windows. Y'all know that? Alright, so we should... push. How, how do you know that? Done it before? Awesome. No. I, I heard it on a movie or something. Okay. Alright, yeah. Spark plug on that. But hold on. That'll make a bunch of noise. I feel like I should get the axe. Alright. I feel like that's stupid too. Alright. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. Porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. It turns what to what? <laughs> Nobody heard that gunshot. All right, we got a weapon now, boys. That's, pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Right, now, we're gonna scramble his brain, but we need to do it from behind. Option to stab him. No, the head, the head. There we go. Whew. There's no get him. Sure. Got them moves like Jagger. Now I get that axe. Yep. Okay, I'll get the axe. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. 
It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Sweet. Two more. That should help. Is this the only way up? Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. <laughs> sure, you go and do everything. We'll be right behind you. <laughs> Thanks. Is there, is there not an option to be like... <laughs> I would try to go into a, a different door or something. Okay, I've got axe in hand. Use it. Use it. I'm clicking. I'm clicking. I'm clicking. Nice. Oh, I'm clicking. Nice. Decapitated. Those look like meth head zombies. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. Glenn, she was not into you. <laughs> if you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. This is a horrible decision. Should be able to move that board. Yeah, no, we're going to have to use my axe. You might want to break through that board first. Yeah. Like, I want to... She get the board on that. I know, right? That's why I was thinking. God. Oh God! I, I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you. I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could have said fine. I'm bit. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? What? <laughs> I don't want that. <laughs> Told it's not you. Christian. Please. Just leave me. He saw her and he liked her. Okay, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So can I borrow it? What do you mean borrow? Give it to me? I can just you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me. We need to get going. I was going to say do it for her. And Give it to me, please. This is crazy. Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one oh, moment. Oh, gosh. And I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. We're gonna have to do it. Yes. Back up, please. Whoa! That went horrible. Whoa! Take it easy. We just want to help. You can't. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. She's a fucking zombie, bro. It's dumb. Just oh, no, no. no! <laughs> That's gonna attract a lot of zombies. <laughs> Should have used the pillow. Let's get out of here. Here they come! Yep. Get in! Everyone alright? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and... Well, yeah. We're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. 
Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. Um, so now we have Axe. We should be able to open door with Axe, right? I think. Yeah, there we go. Okay, no, that was a dumb idea. We need to go use that on the combination lock outside the front. Maybe use the axe to get the... <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's a smart decision there, Dennis. Uh, but you heard what I was really thinking. So this is going to be... This is going to be interesting. Alright, brother. I've got supplies now. Let's go. Come on. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? He seems happy to go look outside, and that's that's. that's Let's weird. have a look around. Okay. Um. I can't reach that brick. What if you had an axe? You could. Um. I can't reach that brick. Oh, God. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, that made absolutely no sound things. at all. Carefully. I can't reach that brick. <laughs> that is fucking hilarious. I want this sound command. I can't command. reach that brick. I can't reach that brick. <laughs> there has to be a sound command. How are we going to distract them? Grab the brick. I can't reach that brick. <laughs> okay, we definitely don't want it over there. We would love it to go through that window. Oh, yes. God, imagine he he nailed it too. All right, use the remote to turn on the TVs. Awesome. Nice. I got an idea. Yep. Yep. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do. What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? Don't you have to like... I memorized all the codes when I was in AV. Let's try. Well fucking done, Doug. Hell yeah, man. Oh, nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? The time. Just, it's time to get the keys. Be careful. Keep an eye out, will you? Hey, bud. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there, you would have died for them. So, yeah, I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, you know why he's standing there, killing the tech bees? He doesn't even have to kill him, he just needs the keys. I know, man. 
man. Fucking did fucking missed and shit. I hit him in the brain. This is horrible. Where the fuck are the keys? This is brutal as shit. Hey bud is the achievement. <laughs> hey bud. <laughs> oh god. There we go. Can only be one. Could we curse? Yeah, you can curse, man. Don't bother me. Holy crap! Just don't say weird shit. That's it. Yeah, thanks for yelling run. Oh, did you leave your axe? He left the axe, didn't he? Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. Bruh. <laughs> I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. She's got a weapon in her uh, shoulder there. Timed up perfectly with Lee saying shit too. Oh yeah. <laughs> Reminds me of Shaun of the Dead. I need the truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the Caroline alley, start getting looking. people out of here. You got it. Bobby Doug, Carly, Brown. and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. Guys, that door's not locked anymore. Huh? Shit! You three, get on it! I'll get back as fast as I can! Stay away from the windows. Let me need your help. Please hurry! So, what am I supposed to be doing? Hey, Lee. If we don't make it through this, you should know that I think you're a great guy. We will make it through this! Doug, if we don't make it through this, <laughs> I know. Uh, I was like, man, he's just like, he's like, uh, oh, okay, more weird shit? Okay. I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit. Oh, this is, this is bad. Are you sure? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, then. Give it time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. Go get the cane. Good time. Did you find anything? Nothing. Oh, wait. That window is screwed. Go. Come on, duck, duck. Oh, Q, 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 Decision time. Save this dude. Reason being, she knows all of my dark secrets. And anybody can shoot a gun. And he knows how to program remotes. That should that's gonna be it's gonna be worth. Ladies first, I'm done. <laughs> 
He showed he Let's has go. more skills. <laughs> they got Carly. You gotta move. To oh no, hell no. Take take the Run, run. Okay, whatever. We're running. Son of a bitch. No! Oh no! I knew I fucking hated him. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Yeah, come on, let's go. Especially a good friend. Oh, that dude is so dead. Let's get out. Close the door. That dude is fucking dead. Clint is losing options fast. Yeah. That guy is a douche. Yeah, he's done. That guy is absolute garbage. <laughs> At Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. <laughs> Secrets intact. <laughs> Sounds like they're having problems down there. Okay. Hey, Glenn. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening there. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Wonder who's gonna get him out of the freezer this time when he gets in Atlanta. Why did he wave her away? I don't understand. I think that's the wrong call. Gotta do what you gotta do. Find your friends. Oh, God, it sounds stupid. I think you're making the wrong call. Maybe. Or the tank. Make the wrong call oh, wait, he got make the brick right out of the tank? Not. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. We got, we got Glenn out of a, like, freezer. Yeah, but the show Glenn gets Rick out of the tank in Atlanta. Oh, okay. Okay. Hey, kid. Close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. Earlier, I uh, mentioned you gotta ask yourself what you're gonna do if Clementine's parents don't show. Yeah, you did. You think that's gonna happen? Her parents showing up? No, I don't. Well, I want you to know that I think you've got it in you. I think you can take care of that little girl just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. Thanks, Kenny. Alright, where... I want to know where that piece of crap went. The, the old man that punched him. How you doing, Doug? Doug? We couldn't save her, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I... I know Same. it's stupid. We just met. It's dumb. But, uh, I mean, it's, it's probably just that survivor thing. But I really liked her. She liked you, too. I'll just lie to him. <laughs> anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. 
I understand. Wait, Lee? What is it, buddy? How did you choose? I mean, we both needed you. You picked me. I'm just gonna say I'm gonna help them both. That makes sense, I guess. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish you would have picked her. Well, shit, let me rewind. Hold on a second. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, God. All right. There's no telling what would have really happened, though. I could have saved her first, and maybe she could have, like, turned around and shot the zombie that was... That's the dude. Dead. I thought Super Dinosaur was toast. But you know what? Kill that he guy. Wasn't. Oh, and then... Hey, Duck, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm I gotta bounce later, dude. Take it easy, Dennis. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. Oh, it's gone. Baby. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. <sighs> Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. Clementine, another thing. Oh, God, that kid. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me, so... Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you... <laughs> you watch your ass. Hey, Lee... Do you have a second? My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That reporter is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Oh, yeah, you're right. Seems better than a mountain. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. <laughs> Oh. Mountain's sounding pretty good now. All the power's gone. <laughs> to be continued. Next time on The Walking Dead. I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. You look like crap, Lee. When was the last time you ate? Keep it. Hey, I owe you a lot more than a half-eaten candy bar. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy. I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fuck with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Okay. Honesty. Lied to Herschel. You and 63% were honest. Okay. Uh, 
Who would you save, Duck or Sean? I saved the kid. Loyalty side with Kenny. I think I made a mistake when I was making those choices, so... Mercy gave Irene the gun. No, we didn't do that because she could have been a crackhead and she could have shot us. Uh, who would you save, Doug or Carly? You and t only 23% saved the dude? Oh my gosh, thirsty bitches. Thirsty bitches. Y'all, everybody out there trying to, trying to get with that.